Hansen's on Funeral Home, the North Chapel on Highway 21 in Sylacauga, and the Childersburg Chapel on Highway 280 in Childersburg for pre-need, funerals, burials, or cremation since 1975. Uh, Curtis and Son Funeral Home, Sylacauga, Childersburg, 256-245-4361. Uh, the North Chapel on Highway 21 in Sylacauga and the Childersburg Chapel on Highway 280 in Childersburg. Since the mid-70s, Curtis and Son Funeral Home has been serving uh, the funeral home needs of uh, uh, families and individuals uh, in this area for a long, long time, and they continue to do so today. That's Curtis and Son Funeral Home, Sylacauga, Childersburg. In obituary news this morning, Geekia Green uh, public viewing will be uh, tomorrow, Friday, from 3 to 7 at SM Goodson Funeral Home and Crematory. Ms. Green, age 23, there'll be a funeral service on Saturday at 1 p.m. from SM Goodson Funeral Home Chapel in Talladega with burial in the Knoxville Cemetery. SM Goodson Funeral Home and Crematory in charge of the arrangements. And uh, funeral service for Mr. Donald Don Harville, age 88, of Winneboro. That service this morning at 11 a.m. from Winneboro uh, Baptist Church. Interment in the Evergreen Cemetery here in Sylacauga. Don was a longtime fixture in Winneboro, loved his community, loved his school, he's a member of the quarterback club there, and also uh, he filmed the football games uh, for Winneboro. And uh, he was a timekeeper for the basketball games. And also, he's a founding member of the Plank Road Station Lodge. Funeral service for Don Harville, age 88, is this morning at 11 a.m. from Winneboro Baptist Church, burial in Evergreen Cemetery in Sylacauga, Earthsbury Funeral Home in Talladega, in charge of the arrangements. Funeral arrangements to be announced later uh, today for Mr. William Dunlap, who uh, passed away in Texas on Monday, Curtis and Son Funeral Home, North Chapel, announcing the arrangements. Visitation for Rodney Smith, age 70. That visitation is going to be today from noon until 2 at Curtis and Son North, with a funeral service to follow at uh, 2 p.m., from the North Chapel of Curtis and Son Funeral Home, Reverend Brandon Baird, pastor at Second Baptist Church in Wagufka, officiating that service, burial in the Evergreen Cemetery, uh, Curtis and Son Funeral Home, North Chapel, in charge of the arrangements. Also, uh, William Bill Collinback, uh, Coach K, uh, that funeral service. Uh, Visitation will be later today, 5 till 8, at the Childersburg Chapel at Curtis and Son Funeral Home. Funeral service will be on Friday at First Methodist Church in Sylacauga Visitation from 1 until 2, and the funeral service at 2, all from Childersburg First Methodist Church. Reverend John Limbaugh officiating in the service. Burial in the Green Hill Memorial Gardens of Childersburg. Uh, Coach K, as he is affectionately known, uh, passed away on Tuesday. Uh, he was a longtime uh, uh, coach and uh, coach at Childersburg uh, with Coach John Cox for many years. Matter of fact, the field house is named after uh, Coach K, uh, Coach uh, William Bill Collinback. He was a great guy, and uh, he, he will be missed and remembered uh, all under the direction of Curtis and Son Funeral Home, Childersburg Chapel. Rebecca Yolanda Wright, age 66. Visitation is tonight, 5 till 8, at Curtis and Son Funeral Home, North Chapel in Sylacauga. Funeral service is Friday at 2 p.m. from the North Chapel of Curtis and Son with the Reverend Wayne Fowler officiating burial in the Evergreen Memorial Cemetery, Curtis and Son Funeral Home, directing. 
and Joel Bearden, age 75, of Alpine, died on January 28th at his residence. Visitation will be Saturday, <clears throat> 10 until 11 o'clock at the North Chapel of Curtis and Son. And the funeral service to follow at 11, uh, all at Curtis and Son Funeral Home, North Chapel on Saturday. Reverend Mike Dankson officiating burial in the Evergreen Memorial Cemetery on the Talladega Highway in Sylacauga. This obituary report this morning uh, brought to you by Curtis and Son Funeral Home. One other obituary to share with you this morning, visitation for Bonnie Heath, age 70, of Sylacauga will be Saturday, 1 until 2 o'clock at Radley Smith Funeral Home, followed by memorial service at 2, all at Radley Smith on Saturday. Radley Smith Funeral Home in Sylacauga in charge of the arrangements. These obituaries courtesy of Curtis and Son Funeral Home, Sylacauga, Childersburg, 256-245-4361, pre-need to at-need funeral services, funerals, burials, or cremation since 1975. Curtis and Son Funeral Home, Sylacauga, Childersburg.